sat there and Mr. Henry looked at me and he goes, you need to stop doing short films and you need to start working on a, on a feature. And I told him, "Are you? do you want me to work on a feature for my senior project? He goes, do you think you can do it? And I was like, I can do anything, especially if you're trying to Walking into the classroom and then he's got, you know, uh, drawings of, of the rig that, you know, is going to be set up for, for the driving shot. Uh, you can't have people on the team that, that are doubtful of, of what's going on. You, you want to be working with people who are confident. I found out about this through, through Backstage, and uh, you know, they, they, have a little, they have a little synopsis on there, and I read it, and I just immediately fell in love with uh, the character of Marcus. Mark was always good about you know, giving direction, Manny about where to stand, and sort of where the, the, the camera would catch the best the best image. Some people doubted us, and that was one of part of my motivations, because I realized if, if we get this done, shooting a full length feature film, and we're undergraduate students, that's something, that's something. Marcus, wait. What the fuck do you want, Lisa? I'm sorry, Marcus. Oh, you're sorry, really? Wait. Lisa, why are you standing in front of me? You and Jerry and your lawyer said everything you needed to say to me in there, right? I was going to tell you. I was. Believe it or not, I don't like the way Jerry wants to handle your relationship with Haley, but I'm only trying to do what's best for my daughter. Our daughter, Lisa. Our daughter. You didn't make that little girl by yourself. And Jerry, sure, she had nothing to do with bringing her into this world. And now you're letting that widow tell me when I can see my own daughter? And how much more money I need to pay you when you already have this perfect ass life? What happened to you? You happened to me. Lisa, honey. Come on. Let's go. You know, that little girl's gonna wonder who mommy and daddy were before mommy decided to leave daddy. And then she's gonna see that everything you are is nothing but a bunch of bullshit ass lies. You were nothing when we came to Houston. And as far as I'm concerned, you still ain't shit, Lisa. You're just another parasite sucking onto another man's life. Lisa! You better go ahead and go. Your pimp's calling you. 